so hey guys welcome back to the channel people here hope you all doing well so welcome back to vs arts and today i will be showing you a editing tutorial of pixarts i hope to create a ring light how to transform this photo into this so let's get started with our pixart editing So guys here we are in Pixart so we'll just oh, I will show you how, which photo I will be editing today so I will be taking this photo so just select the whichever photo you have uh, you want to edit and uh, go to first of all uh, sticker and in the sticker you will found uh, you have to found ring light you know there are uh, by default there are uh, this blue one and this pink one but if you want to search you can search also you know there are uh, several uh, items over here you can choose whichever you like so if you want the neon one And choose that also you know these are the neon lines but we will be going with uh, this you have you uh, as per your need you can go with whichever uh, you know ring you can go but I will be choosing this one because this is by default on the you know sticker option so you will find it very easily on the Pixart app so just make that ring a little bigger so can be you know, adjust on the photo so this is a little adjustment you have to make and after that go to the erase tool on the top and just erase the excess so you have to erase all the things from the shoulder and you have to just make it like the ring is from her shoulder on the back of the shoulder so we have just created this ring and uh, if you want to adjust it you can adjust by you know the amount and all that stuff but I will keep it uh, like this only so if anything is showing it just rub it all over it and uh, hit yes okay on the top right so we will be good to go and after that you have to go to the draw draw menu go to draw and you will see this options over here so go to first the color the default selected is black so select the pink color it will give a nice neon effect so and uh, go to this button on the brush icon the default will be this you have to just choose this brush and uh, I'll turn the opacity 200 size to uh, 128 and go to set after setting all the things we have to just draw a random line over the photo so this is the random line I have drawn and after that we have to go to top right uh, bottom extreme right and select this layer and uh, hit on this and empty layer so this this layer will be created after that layer is created click the uh, different color I will be uh, choosing a blue color and draw uh, another random line so another random line is created and draw another empty layer and uh, draw another blue line so this line are looking not good now but I will transform the line into and it will look so select any of the layers I will select the pink one first and go to three these three options and go to transform so transforms makes your line you know you can edit the line so as you can see I will be uh, zooming this uh, pink line into a uh, gradient type effect this is a professional word for it gradient effect so I will I have created a nice gradient effect over the photo so if you are satisfied with the line or gradient just hit ok go to next layer click on transform make sure you click transform whenever you you know are editing that lines and just and 
select the third layer do the same thing click transform and create uh, another gradient over it so if you are satisfied with it hit ok uh, it might change with uh, uh, according to your you know photo which photo you have and all the stuff so uh, select the first layer and as you can see this uh, on the there is normal selected but you have to overlay it so it will be look you know look different on the normal it has like a bit it's look like you know we have added some synthetic or after the photo is look don't look natural so go to this and add a uh, there are various options multiply will multiply the current light and will add light darken will uh, dark all the uh, lights and shadows screen will uh, or, you know add or dissolve the color and uh, add will uh, add option is for adding another layer overlay is uh, the best option here so just click on overlay so as you can see the pink light has become a very uh, you know uh, it has uh, decreases its opacity and uh, created a nice natural effect for it so go to second uh, this blue layer and click to overlay and go to third layer and click to overlay so as you can see it's now look very natural and dreamy type of it so i will show you uh, what if i use the another uh, screen version so as you can see the screen screen version will light, lighten up the effect and if you choose the dark it will just dark the effect it, uh, if you choose the light and it will light the effect and if you choose multiply it will uh, destroy your image so the best option here is uh, overlay or screen uh, according to image uh, to the dark and uh, light side of it you can choose whatever you like and uh, this you can increase or decrease the opacity whenever you like so i will keep it uh, 100 or 92 as per the photo but if the photo is looking very good so guys this is the photo we have got so hit uh, ok and uh, export your photo save your photo and uh, all the stuff you, you can you know easily upload it on instagram or anything it looks so natural and it looks like you have edited in three two to three hours of editing so this was a short tutorial about uh, how to you know transform your photo and add a ring light over it so hope you guys like this video and if you like this video subscribe to my channel share it with your friends and follow me on instagram for all the further updates and uh, i do all the photography and art stuff so check out in my channel also there are uh, various playlists in my app button i will be giving so check out that also so up till now guys keep creating thick big and peace out